Hi everyone, today I'm going to, going to review this, the LBX Buster. LBX stands for Little Startler Experience, also known as uh, Dango Sinky. It's a game produced by the company Level 5. It was released in June 2011 as a role-playing game, and the first anime series arrived in March 2011 too, and it had three seasons, and I watched it, but I don't remember much. All I remember is a story set in the world in the year 2046. Human invented some kind of a super hard, super durable, durable cock box. <laughs> and some kids think this box is perfect for fighting with a remote control robot. So many company later start releasing LBX. And the plots of the story after that were basically like Andy used Buzz and Woody to help me get over my depression. <laughs> and this Buster is from season 2, which I watched too, like 6 or 7 years ago. I don't remember much. I even don't remember this guy appear in the series. But recent time when I saw this guy the first time, I love it. Immediately. The design of this area is not too complicated. Probably because the purpose of this area is a map production. It's supposed to an army, so not too complicated. It has the same frame tie at the LBX Achilles, 9 frame. Many LBX in the series use this frame type because it's a very balanced. It has a jetpack so it can fly and it has the gun. Look like the Achilles disc but had been customized. And this Abiot Mordekit was released in 2013. That means this guy is almost 10 years old. ABS model kit Bandai usually for kit, so it won't be too complicated. It's easy to build, don't even need to use nipper. Just snap the pack out of the runner. And because they are simple, easy to peel, so their color separation is not the best. Depending on the design of the ABX, Bandai will slap a huge sticker on your face and luckily for my favorite abs this guy is a uh, grunks he don't have any sticker but you still need an orange sticker in his wing right here i painted it you have the white sticker in his front strut and in his head and i only use the reflected sticker on his face and those logo sticker on his wing but still <coughs> some detail they don't give you sticker so maybe it may bother you, like inside the, the orange inside the thruster, dark gray in the feet, and all the color at the gun. The head can look up and down, it's a body cap joist. The arm can raise up that far, and inside the arm is a big bow joint. So very much you can rotate the arm. Rotation at the bicep. And those every kids they have very unique hinge joint. You see right now, it's the bend not much, but you can extend the joint a little bit, and you can bend ninety degree now. It's it's cool. We have the ball joint at the hand, but uh, it's a little stiff and kind of hard to move. The weight is a peg. It can rotate. Front skirt can lift up that far. The sky size skirt is a ball joint, can move freely. The leg is a ball joint, it can kick that far. And usually, those hinge joint at the knee of the ABA kit, it can extend the joint like the arm and move can move more. First, the guy don't have that. And it can still bend 90 degrees, so the connection to the feet is a ball joint. You can up and down, little pivot, and rotate. The wing itself it cannot do anything, it's just there. You can stick it into the buster back, very simple, and now he can fly. Close talk, although it's the intended for children, it's cheap and quite lacking of color, sticker hell, but it's not bad a model game. But when you 
then building it, you will have the one LBX. It exact same scale in the anime. The second, the act the articulation is not extreme good, but it's not bad. You can still have a lot of good posts like I do right here. And that's it. Thank you so so much for watching my video. Recently, I got 100 hours of viewing and 83 subscribers right now. I mean, it's not much, but I feel really happy. Like a little kid getting a new toy right now. Well, have a long way to go so thank you so much for joining with me supporting this fucking man child <laughs> more ABS review and hobby review will coming thank you you guys and see you next time